The following is a Just Green production brought to you by the Might Be News Network. What up, everybody? This is Relatable Radio, where it is always ladies' night. My name is Jackie, and I have here with me Amy. Hello. And Allison. What up? And Taylor. Hi, everybody. And Taylor and I are back. Yeah. We missed last week. We're back. The, the Mother's Day episode. <laughs> but I hope you ladies had a fantastic Mother's Day. Thank you. Yeah, um, we did. Awesome I, yeah, Day. I listened I listen to the show. So, you um, <laughs> yeah, it sounds like, you know, it went good, which is great. I was, it was good. Yeah. I'm happy that your husbands came through. Well, some more than others, because I know some are really good at always pulling through. (laughs) Kevin Kevin totally like blew it out of the park. Like he did. He did so good. Now his problem is he's setting that bar. Yeah, he set a bar. You did it last year. (laughs) Yeah, did so good. I mean, it was. And I told and I posted on Facebook too that like this was hands down the best Mother's Day I've ever had. That's great. It was so good. It was perfect. It was great. I loved it. That's awesome. It's a great job, Kev. Woohoo! Coming back. Yeah, you guys that, did I'm nice to saying that. Good job, Kev. Yeah, good yeah. job, Kev. <laughs> now we'll have to make a, a good I know. a good sounder for him. No. I'm proud of you, Kev. <laughs> no, I'm probably nah. gonna make a good one. For yeah, the best, Kev. I don't can't let his ego get too big. <laughs> but I don't anticipate needing to again. use it very much. No. So yeah. It'd be a waste of time. But so. no, you guys did a great job last week uh without us here. And Steve again, was great. shout out yeah, to Steve. He was. And you see Peter our apartment. I know. Oh, I you. did. I forgot. I did. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so we're walking. Though, listen. So we're walking out. Like we're all like in the hallway. Yeah. almost like what you know, walking out. And um, I had said Kevin was planning on messing with your remotes. Right. And I was like, oh, I wonder if he did that. And then Alice and I are standing there, and I'm like, oh, I feel like like we got to do something, yeah. right? And she's like, just leave. She's like. We're going to TP the place. <laughs> and I was like, I'm totally down. Let's do it. Well, first Insult I thought like. Insult to injury. You used our own toilet paper. We were. It's so funny. She said that. She's like. I did. I, Jackie's going to be so pissed off. Yeah. Because we used entire. I, used I was like, I know paper. this is our toilet paper. <laughs> and, she, and she's going to be mad because it's a waste of toilet paper. Yeah. And she I don't like wasting toilet paper. Things. We know. You know. I even thought about redirect, like redecorating your apartment and i was like no oh. that's a little much oh god it was a mess i cleaned yesterday if you can't it looks tell. really good <laughs> yeah no, i can tell it looks awesome what's so. funny is, is that <laughs> when we got home i uh i came in first because I, I was bringing stuff in and she was getting some things situated outside and i came in and i was like these motherfuckers <laughs> yeah, he didn't and even then, forewarn me I he just let even, me walk in and i was like what is i didn't this? say anything to her about it so th- <laughs> just so that like i could see her yeah, actual reaction. About right. It if you had too. thought about it, you would have known it was us. Yeah. Because you were the last ones. We were here. the last ones here, yeah. and yeah. there's no way what how the TP was arranged. Right. It was very. There's no graceful. way anybody could have sat at so the I table and recorded. I didn't think about that at first. Like I did, like once it like settled in for a second. Yeah. yeah. I was like this had to have been the well, girls I, I because this, snap. the quote unquote studio is all toilet all, paper yeah. too. So and like, no there's no way that you guys would have sat in this and done what you did. So like that, I put it together pretty quick, but it wasn't at first. I just imagined. Kevin and Danny running around our yeah, ass they, apartment. Just with they the were like, oh, you'll you'll figure something else out soon. And like immediately, like when the remote didn't work, I like check batteries. Yeah. 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 But yeah. my sister was like, um, it not that it would necessarily start a fire, but she's like, I think her kids put the batteries in wrong and her remote got super hot one time. That's so weird. she's like, I don't know if it can start a fire or not, but I just noticed that hmm. my batteries were in backwards and my remote got really hot. So she didn't know if that was the correlation or. Huh. But How I was like, well, that sucked if you came home and right. your apartment was on fire. Yeah. Of Kevin. <laughs> yeah. That would have been a whole new come on, Kev. <laughs> sounder. Right. Oh, my God. That would have been a probably an hour and a half. Come on, Kev. Yeah. Sounder. <laughs> or just destroy Kev. As soon as I saved up enough money to rebuy the Buy studio. <laughs> oh my God. This is why we have insurance. Like, right. We have renters. Insurance. <laughs> That's why you have that. Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. But so, I'm glad you guys had a good Mother's Day, though. Yeah, yeah thank yeah. you, Jackie. Good. How you? How was your vacation? It was good. We, um, so we, I, I can't, I can't afford plane tickets. <laughs> okay, plane tickets are crazy Everyone's like, expensive. Oh, it's only like three hundred dollars. I'm like, oh, I know I have that's a bill. Dollars. Yeah, yeah. So, um, I put it in my head. I was like, okay, well, I'm sure I can drive to South Carolina. And then I was like, wait, I wonder if I could drive. Taylor to like North Carolina, he can see his dad, and then 
I can stay the night and then wake up and then go to South Carolina. So it's not one huge leg. Right. Yeah. Um, but I, I honestly think like by going to North Carolina, it took me maybe two hours out of the way. But yeah. Um, bad, it broke the trip up really nice, actually, because the rental we had was Saturday to Monday. So we left on Friday. Gotcha. So we stayed the night at Taylor's dad's house and um, Taylor and Finn and Alan hung out all weekend. And yep. um, me and another girl just drove the next morning. Well, we got new wiper blades. <laughs> yeah, we had to get new wiper blades. Oh, my wiper blades were awful. We, really had some, sad, we had worst. some pretty extreme rain on the way down. It wasn't. It didn't last long, but it was pretty crazy. And yeah, her wiper blades were trash. Where you're like, you're you're <laughs> putting your hazard lights on that kind of crazy oh, wow. rain. So the next morning we went and got new wiper blades, and I was like, holy shit, this is amazing. Yeah, life changing. <laughs> yeah. I always get the driver side one, the really expensive version, and then the passenger side I get like a cheaper blade for that side, so huh. I can see really huh. well out of the. So I don't have to spend yeah. the money on two really nice ones. I yeah. just get the really, yeah, the but I really good quality ones for my side. We spent like what, maybe the Rain X ones, thirty six dollars on yeah, wiper blades. Something like that. The driver side was like is ginormous mm-hmm. compared to the passenger side, mm-hmm. and I think my old car they were like basically the same size. So it looked. I was like, this can't be right. This, this is, is weird. This is a baby. <laughs> it's not <laughs> fully <baby> grown. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the driver side was like. 19 bucks and the passenger was like 13 so it's really not too yeah, bad it's not bad it's crazy that like every car is different with the wiper blades as far mm-hmm. as like like it, it took us a few a few minutes to figure out how to change these stupid things because all of them are so different thank you, know? you like, internet yeah thank you internet mm-hmm. but we got it. it done it was fun it was a good weekend it was a good, good weekend i i it, the greatest part about it was that for me at least other than seeing my dad and hanging out with him um <clears throat> was I wasn't worried about the shows at all. Yeah. I wasn't like, worried at all. Right. That was a really cool no, thing. No, wait, really? Like, you really weren't worried at I all? Really I really wasn't worried. You were Like, you really weren't? No, because no, Steve came over a no, couple Steve of times I, I prior was, I was, to... I was, I was more... I wasn't even... I wasn't worried at all. I'll say that. But I was available for Steve. We had... Like, well, my yeah. phone is on, yeah, he, on yeah. silent on, all the time. On but Friday, I it on. on the car <laughs> ride down, he's like, okay, he might call, like, any minute because the guy should be showing up soon and... We were like, you know, obviously still in the car, but I, I said uh, like called. 20 minutes after I said that, I was just like, well, he hasn't called. So everything's going oh, good. Yeah. He was totally like he he obviously knew what he was yeah. doing. Yeah. Um. Well, he studied. And he, there were even like some issues. Yeah. And like he, our like, mics weren't yeah. working. Handled and he, it. Like, he got yeah. it. It was all good. Good. We don't well, need he you went anymore. to Connecticut school <laughs> broadcasting. How long ago did he go through the program there? I think it was a while ago. I don't yeah. know. It was a few years. It's like I think. riding a bike. Yeah. I mean, once I, I showed him, he he even sat here and like filmed me doing <laughs> he, this. He told me that. And oh, uh, so he had a video reference and everything, and uh, he did his homework. And like I said, I I wasn't worried at all about it. I wasn't worried about you guys. Yeah. Like you guys well, show that, up you and do your thing. I knew. C- I knew you guys were CJ fun. had to do. Novak and Franz, Novak and too. Franz, last, the last that's episode. Good. We had stomach bugs, guys. Right before, oh, that's right before right. Bachelor Party. That's right. Pee-poops. What's going around Saturday? right now? Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have people. I just threw up once and then had a fever that I had to break and just felt like crap. And I'm glad it. Bro- you were I good by the time you left, though, on Friday, right? I wanted no real food, though. I was like, like that last week, actually. I wanted nothing. I was, I was eating, very nauseous. I was eating goldfish in the morning. And it was like, well, actually, that's all I would eat at work was goldfish because it was all I wanted. I didn't want anything heavy. Yeah. yeah. And then thankfully, by the time Saturday rolled around, we got breakfast. Jess and I went to South Carolina. We had to go to the Tanger outlets down there because we, we couldn't get into the house just yet. Mm-hmm. Um, I severely, I did not pack right, by the way. Like, I think because I was sick and just didn't really have time to prep and plan and do laundry um, I mean, we did laundry, but I, I packed, we, of all the clothes we washed, I packed none of them. And I was like, the whole point oh of us God. doing laundry was for me to pack some of this stuff. So I was like, I fucked up. Yeah. I fucked up major. I, I didn't have any comfy shorts to lounge in. I'm like, I'm oh, going to no. South Carolina. What am I going to wear pants all weekend? Yeah. No time for pants. So I went to Old Navy and got, I actually got like nice black shorts to wear out. Nice. And then comfy shorts, and a comfy tank top because I only packed one bummy T-shirt. It was my mm. Jaws T-shirt, so it was appropriate. <laughs> but I'm like, I, I fucked up. But I remembered my wig. 
which Allison, oh, that's that was so you're fun. All the things to, with all the ladies. I know, yeah. to but it's cut. so funny. Like we bump it. Like there was another group of like like a bachelor party there, right? Yeah. And they're like, well, your wig doesn't look real. I'm like, yeah, no shit. It's a, yeah. it's a colored it's wig. wig. It's, it's it fucking look real. black roots. You can clearly see the root is not even black. Like you can see where the stitching of the hair yeah. is. Yeah. And it's fades to fucking blue. Yeah, I'd be like, oh man, I didn't man, fucking fool oh, you. Oh man, I can't believe this doesn't look right. real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> but I, it needs bangs or something. Okay. I'd really like to wear it again to get my eighteen dollars worth. But that's um, fair. Okay. Yeah. Because I I didn't want to buy a wig to begin with because I was I mean, like Taylor. I don't know. Broke. What do you think of the wig? Maybe she could use it for some Ooh. extra. Yeah, we're gonna activities. we're gonna act wow. like complete strangers at a bar, and then yeah, that could yeah, be fun. Take Spicy. You home. No marriage can get a little slow sometimes. Cheating yeah. on you with so, you. Yeah. Cheating see? on you with you. What would be your name? <laughs> oh God. I, I don't know. I feel like. Hold on. Let me think. Something sexual. <laughs> <laughs> you got the Candy or something. <laughs> Candy. Hey, my name is Candy. Sexual candy. Sexual. <laughs> Something Sexual. hard for you to put in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Suck on this. <laughs> You're gross. You're gross. You're gross. His, so his parents are in town, and he played the the Kevin sounder, and then he played mm. the two sounders we made, like yeah. the nice one of him and then the, the mean one for yeah. him. Yep. And I completely forgot that I shout in there. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> dick is huge. Oh, my God. I thought they laughed. but oh, they totally would laugh. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. sure they this loved it. Funny. Oh, God, this they did. Funny. They were cracking up. Yeah, they, they know. They yeah, know they, 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 we had to play, play it again. 25 years. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. they were laughing so hard. So they missed, like, what comes after that because you're laughing so hard. Because yeah. it catches you off guard. Because even I sat there. I was like, oh, God. I forgot about it. Whoops. A little embarrassed. Well, it, they obviously knew that, like, I wrote that line yeah. for you. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, yeah. I don't think my mom was like, oh, Jack. Jackie? <laughs> how could you say that about my son? Yeah. I'm sure your mom knows how big your dick is. Yeah, Let's be honest. Does. I mean. Well, <laughs> when's the last time your mom? It's been, been a long time. Yeah. It's been a long yeah. time. You're been like, yeah. maybe body training. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a so long like time. a couple years ago. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time. Time, I think, yeah, it's funny. Oh I didn't even God. realize how oh much time God. until you asked. Yeah, but it's been a long time. He's 33 now. Uh, yeah. You don't take time out of your day to think about how long it's, it's been. Probably a solid 30 just, years. Just, my mom has known Kev for 25 years, and it's been way longer than that since she's seen yeah. my dick. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, I was so not funny. expecting the conversation. I mean, I no. know I brought it up, but I was not expecting this to go here. Yeah. Penis just, talk. This yeah. is what we're our show's what about. Yeah, I'll tell you what. I'll, I'll tell you uh, so, something real quick just before we get much you further. Tell us how big your dick yeah. is. Uh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> dick game <Yeah>. strong. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Like a tripod. You just plop it on the table like. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, Patreon, Patreon, Patreon. We uh, This is the first episode, 90 minutes for you guys. Ooh, I'm excited. Yeah, yeah we're going to keep going. Yep. Uh, the exit music's going to s- start at an hour. And um, everybody who's been listening to us uh, that is used to our hour-long episodes, you're still going to get that every week. Uh, but if you want more might be news network in all sense of the word uh go to patreon and check it out we're it, we're recording on sunday right now we're experiencing some, some technical difficulties with it but uh spiritual and technical guru cj is on the case and <laughs> yeah. uh we're gonna get it figured out so hopefully by the time you're listening to this on tuesday all you have to do is go to patreon.com and search for might be news network and download the app. There's download an app the for app. That. Yep. I just downloaded it today. Okay. Super easy. You can listen to account. the shows directly on the app. You can listen to the shows directly on your computer, whatever you want to do. You can download the shows, take them with you. Um, there's three tiers, uh, bronze, silver, and gold. There's a ton of different uh, incentives and different things that go along with those things. It's very easy and self explanatory to look at. Um, Go check it out. Go check it out. If you want 90-minute episodes of your favorite shows, uh, this is the best way to get it. We're talking about doing exclusive Patreon shows, like uh, the three three of the four of us here love Game of Thrones. Yes, we want to do. do. We want to do like a Game of Thrones recap, summary episode, something. Yeah. Just talk, discussion with 
multiple people from chew out. into a microphone at yeah. one point. Yeah. 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 Yep. We'll do she's going to do the cooking right. show. She's yeah. going to be head Abby chef cook. of the cooking show. Sounds wonderful. And I mean, there's a ton of <laughs> ideas going around. There's a ton of ideas going around. Uh, yeah. We're talking about doing a fantasy football league for the uh, for the network and having a random show about that. We're talking about and if the you Game guys want to, if thing. you guys have any ideas of things that you want to see, yeah. or people that like you want to match up and have a conversation, or if you want to, you know, whatever, let us know. Um, we're open to. to if you whatever. think we should start doing rap battles, if you, oh my god, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Allison would totally be in. Yeah, yeah. I do it at my kitchen table. <laughs> That'd be hysterical. Yeah. <laughs> Allison versus Kevin, round one. <laughs> oh my God. But if there's if there's things that you want us to talk about, if there and that's not just for per show, but if if you want to hear from the people from the network, we'll figure out a time to get together people from different shows and talk about Game of Thrones. Yeah. Talk about whatever. I think we should go back through watch and then talk about it. So you can and if last. anyone wants American Idol, I got I got you. <laughs> <laughs> I I did tell my friend who is an actual doctor that I yeah am an honorary doctor because I watch Grey's Anatomy. I I think we all could yeah. totally yeah. be surgeons. Yeah, for sure. So I mean, you guys could definitely Grey's have Anatomy. a Grey's Anatomy. Yeah. I think we've we've done that That's over the more yeah. or less your show. Like we've already weeks, done that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, but uh, yeah, Patreon, patreon.com. Go check it out. Search for Might Be News Network. And um, hopefully you can find us. That's the technical issue right now is that we aren't showing up on there. But I am I can see it because I made we'll it. We'll get it all straightened out. <laughs> We're going to I mean, when I say we, up. I mean CJ. Like yeah. I said, <laughs> CJ's on the case. CJ will do CJ's it. CJ's on the case and he has literally never let me down. So I. Uh, no pressure. I believe. Yeah, no pressure, CJ. Uh, but yeah, go check it out because I'm telling you, we're going to be offering a lot of stuff with this thing. Uh, like I said, though, if you don't want to pay, and you, you guys don't get be, like free shit, yeah, mm-hmm. free shit. You get uh, the tears. You want me to go into tears? I can do it. Yeah, let's do yeah. this. Let's right. do this. Thing. So uh, the bronze, the bronze <laughs> level, you get the uh, it's five dollars a month, and uh, you get all the ninety minute episodes that we put out, and a t shirt of your choice, whatever show that you want, nice, whatever show that you want, relatable radio, yeah, obviously. of course, right. And when you sign up for any of these things, it asks for your address. The only reason that we're asking for your address is so that we know where to send the shit that we want to give you. Right? right. So it makes sense. Silver, $10 uh, a month, 90-minute episodes. You get the T-shirt. You get an autographed copy of Incredible Baseball Stats by Kevin Reevy and uh, 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 Ryan, Ryan Spader. Spader. And you get one entry into uh, our monthly giveaways. We're going to be doing monthly giveaways as well. Different things. All kinds of stuff. Um, <clears throat> the next thing that you get for the silver is you get access to the uh, exclusive shows, like the Game of Thrones thing, the blah blah yeah. blah thing, whatever. <clears throat> thing. Uh, silver, that's silver. Gold is fifteen a month, ninety minute episodes. The T-shirt, you get the autograph book, you get an autograph piece of exclusive Novak and Franz uh, uh merchandise, and you get uh two entries into the monthly giveaway. Boom. And all oh, the yep. shows, all nice. the shows, all the shows, and we're going to be adding things to these tiers as we go along as well. This is just kind of like us to getting get us started, up and up and going. It actually was kind of hard figuring out what we were going to do for this because I want to make sure that throughout the entire thing, um, people feel like they're getting what they're paying for. Yeah, and um, I want to consistently. I'm excited about the giveaways every month. I'm excited yeah. about the giveaways. Yeah, yeah. because it's so fun. Uh, like we got, uh, I was talking about it on on Might Be News. We got uh, a glass. One of the guests from uh, Might Be Brews brought it over yeah. for us, and it's really nice. And it's like a really cool idea. That's something you know I'd like to give out a set of glasses. And guys, give think about it this way: cards, if you guys are some like of the that. first ones to sign up and join. There's only limited people at that point, which means you get your name and your chances of winning are like way better. Way yeah. better. So this like true. get get on it. Yep. yep. And we're also, I mean, I'm looking at I love freestyle. I'm new to <laughs> pa- I'm new to Patreon, so I'm 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 obviously new to everything that it offers. And I'm trying to figure all that out. Um if you're questioning whether or not, you know, cuz obviously we've take breaks. We take breaks. Seasons I mean, we would not but like you guys, yeah. S- season start and season ends. And like um I just found this out today by looking at it. Um, if you sign up and we go on break, what I do is I click a button and you don't d- get charged for the month. Oh, that's awesome. Oh. I just found that out today. 
Awesome. I think that's really oh, that's neat. very cool. Because that yeah. was something that I was stressing out about. Well, it's no like, well, I don't know, want people us. to give we money for break, something they're right. not getting. Yeah. And so if we do take a break, season two, at the end of season oh, two, cool. all I do is click one button, boom. Yeah. And I don't, we don't charge anybody their monthly subscription until we come, until back. We come back. That's awesome. Yeah. Like that's that really is. Cool. So that's really neat. And good and, job, Patreon. That's yeah. awesome. I mean, it's great that they think of stuff like that because I. I was thinking about stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> like, are we- I was like, well, maybe we can still continue on. You got two people that know how to work the the board right, now. Right. Like, you know, there's there's always ways around it, and guests that can come on. Like, we would have figured something out. So but this way, this way, it works for everybody. And um, like I said, you can listen to the shows right on the app. Um, they're just going to be a half hour longer, but every show is going to be a half hour longer. You're looking at two two and a half hours of bonus content a week just just for doing that yeah and i'm trying to do these bonus episodes like every other week twice a month yeah. and then maybe some behind the scenes stuff we can post videos on here we can post all kinds of stuff um i can actually update the plan that i'm on and add everybody on there that they can add stuff or do whatever like we we have like our group chat and stuff that yeah. we have, and we're mm-hmm. all hilarious people when we're just talking <laughs> yeah. to each other. And I, I think that which, that would be kind of cool. My, I didn't have my phone this morning, and then I go to my phone. I, it was like probably like two hours where my phone was on the charger, and it's like 28 new messages. I'm like, okay, let me scroll through and catch up to the, <laughs> the group chat. Yeah. I turned off notifications for Messenger, so there's times I get in, and I'm like, oh, God. Yeah. And it's like, I don't even know where there's a lot of us to there. start. I know. And I did watch that thing CJ sent of Vinny. <laughs> yeah, from uh, from, oh, watched what's it. it called? Didn't. You didn't watch it? No. Really sure. His dong is just all out oh, there. Oh, really? Yeah. Wait, wait. Yeah. What day did he send it's it? Nude. Though? I mean, you can't see it. But yeah. oh, I mean, fine, he does like a what, scene. What day did CJ send it in the messenger? Hmm. It was over the week. I don't know which day. Yeah. I was probably at work. Like I, oh, I yeah. can't watch stuff like well, that. Yeah, I forget when it was, but I scrolled past. I it. did see it. <laughs> I bet We're Kev not- watched. You ask him about it. <laughs> he does love the Jersey Shore. I know. But anyway, oh that's my that's my Patreon spiel. Um, we're gonna start taking breaks a little later, and we're gonna just plow right through the uh, the that's credits. What she said. Yep. It's gonna be. Oh. Yeah, yeah. It's good, but it's I, I look at it like a post credit scene because it's it's kind of cool talking after the. The song, That's a yeah, good way yeah. to look you at know, it. like I think it's kind of neat. Like we kind of like just relaxed Marvel. on might be news, which was neat because we have a pretty hard structure throughout mm-hmm. the show. And after we were done, we were just like, cool, right, we like right. we just kind of hang talk. out, yeah. yeah. So like, and you guys are just gonna go off and keep doing your thing. So yeah, yeah. We're, we're, fantastic. Right. I'm not worried not about best. you guys at all. Yeah. No, we're the shit. <laughs> yeah, we're good. So we didn't like do we, like who's the how's the weekend now? I'm done yeah. with Patreon. Done yeah. with Patreon. Go well, check it that out. That was okay. my next question. Nope. We got this. Thanks, Taylor. It's Sunday right. in the recording world. So how was everyone's weekend? Um, so I got together with my siblings yesterday. Yeah, I saw. Oh, a lot, I, saw I saw lots of sushi. Oh sushi. I'm so, so, so much jealous. Sushi. It was so good. Where was it from? Um, the we way. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's oh, right is it one off one thirteen? Z dot w e i. I have no fucking clue how to pronounce it. That, that it's, re- it's right in the like whole Domino? shopping center. Oh. Yes, Domino's. Yeah, Domino's is right there next to it. Oh, I know you're talking yeah. about. It. Okay, yeah. it's just like Kohl's. It's yeah, the Kohl's same is shopping in there. center. And so is that bun cake. No, I was thinking of a different place. That's my bad. Oh, I know what I'm thinking of now. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I was saying where Domino's is. That you're thinking Pizza Hut? Oh, maybe. Oh, oh yeah, all the same. Yeah, yeah, whatever. They're not the same. Um, <laughs> uh, it was my sister's birthday this week, so we got together, hung out. It was awesome. It's always an interesting time when me and my siblings get together. Um, but while we're sitting, so my mom died like eight years ago, as most of you know. Um, and we're sitting there talking, and my siblings start talking about like blankets. Yeah, and I'm like, what? What are you guys talking about? It's like, oh, the blankets mom made for everybody, like that Christmas right before she died. I'm you like, I'm sorry, what? You didn't get a blanket. I didn't get a fucking blanket. <gasps> and Adam's like, my little brother was like, um, I, I think I have your blanket. I'm like, excuse <sighs> me? First of all, how the fuck did this not come up in conversation in the last eight years that you guys all had these blankets that she home she made herself yeah. oh my right God. before she died? And like, nobody, they're like, we thought you knew. And I'm like, no, I didn't fucking know. Because someone has my blanket. Someone has my fucking blanket. So wait, your did brother give has it two you? blankets? What? Does he have two blankets then? Well, supposedly Adam said that he has it in like a box in a closet somewhere. He thinks maybe because he like put it there and was like, oh, I'll worry about this later. 
It's giving me anxiety. You need that blanket. I know. I'm right. like, then, no, but listen, <laughs> blanket. Then he says, or I was, heads are rolled. So pissed. And then my little, my other brother, we were at my brother's house, Joe. <clears throat> he goes and get his blanket, and I'm like, what? The, are you kidding me? Like, what the? Wow. And the actual fuck, guys. So, um, then Adam says, well, you know, I really don't know if there is a blanket. I'm like, wait a second. So first, you're gonna tell me there's a blanket, and you distinctly, obviously, remember. Putting this blanket in a box, in a box right. in a closet somewhere in the house, and now you're telling me is that it, there is no fucking blanket. But does does he have another? Does he have his blanket, and he thinks there's one in a box in a closet, or is that his blanket? No, it's a separate, an okay. additional blanket. Hmm. I, I'm just like mystified yeah. about how this right. all. Where is fucking it happen in eight years. Let's go over and get your and fucking blanket. I told Adam, I'm all like, my that, plans can hold. It better We're fucking show up at my house. Yo, in 20, I'm thinking about New Girl. Yeah. Remember when New Girl and they all go over to get her shit? Yeah, that was like episode like, one, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 We're going to show up. <sighs> so, But now I'm like, I, he texts, I texted him this morning. Where's my over fucking there. blanket? Yeah. That's what your text should read. And he says, yeah, actually, it did kind of said that very, very close to that. He says, if your blanket is in this house, I don't have it. I only have mine. I'll help you look, though. You help me, help me look for something that doesn't exist in my house, so where would it be? Yeah, I don't know. Like, Listen, and it's, huge it's out there. What the f- Guys, I'm this a is firm a believer that St. Anthony will find it. He's the patron saint of lost things, right? articles, whatever the technical term. Like, I've lost so many stupid little things, and if it can be found... St. Anthony's who I pray to. I tell my mom, I'm like, I need all your prayers. I drop my earring and I need to it, find it. It bounced into like the cuff of my jeans oh. from the bathroom. And then when I took them off, it landed. It was on my bed. Just laying Don't, there. Just, just laying perfect. there. Like I pulled back the blanket too. So the blanket uh, had been folded perfect. over on the bed. When I pulled it back, it was under it. Don't ask me how. All day that. Yeah. That's so weird. St. Anthony, he's looking out. So I'm so going to yeah, say some I prayers you, for you. Please yeah. do that. Please yeah. do that. I'm I really, you. I'm I am just like so irritated at my siblings. Not that that's yeah. weird. But did you find that out in the beginning or the end of the this night? Just like halfway through. Okay. Yeah. And so I'm you like, were playing, but you guys got together to do a game night, right? Yeah. Yeah. Did it get real competitive after this information? Because I feel like I would be like so negative that I'd be like, yeah, I'm too. about to win and jam this all no, down. No, I think throat. I was just really excited <laughs> about the fact that there was a blanket in general, right? So like, it kind <laughs> of, I mean, I'm, I'm irritated that I didn't she know that. But blankets. at the same time, like it's now eight years later and it's like right. a gift from my mother. Yeah. Right. Who's been dead for eight years. You'll find it. It'll come around. I just hope it fucking exists because now I got my hopes up. What if he's wrong yeah. and she never made me no. a blanket? Because I was pregnant. You, so this is what I'm thinking. You take I was his pregnant blanket. at the time. So maybe she was like, oh, I'll make a baby blanket for her. And then like after Christmas, and maybe she yeah. never did that because obviously she died at Christmas. So she couldn't have done that. But maybe that's why everybody else got ones and I didn't get one. Or maybe she did. I don't know. Yeah, but yeah. mystery. It's yeah, but she's still handing them out. Whatever. To them. I'm going to All that right. house and finding something, Wait. and I'm going to say that she made it for me, and I'm bringing it home. <laughs> yeah, right. If, I'll you, it. if you go look and you can't find it, I think you need to go to like a medium or something. Yeah, I've done that before. Have you? Actually, I have an appointment for a medium. I was going to say we next do. year because <laughs> she's like books way far in advance. So next August, I have an appointment for me, and I'm gonna I'll have where's to bring she, that up. Where's yeah, she? Yeah, just keep thinking answer. about the blanket. I went Maybe to her before through because my I know somebody like my best friend told me. That her sister's like best friend, their their the dad died. They went to see medium. I think she, I think it was somebody in Westchester. Nelly Walters, the same. I don't know the name. Okay, but they just said she knew. She was saying details. Yeah, yeah. no, this about is, the death. It's probably her. Nobody. Uh, yeah, there's when no I way. Saw her she before, was telling me this, and I had chills over my body. The, the stuff that she told me, even not about just my mom, but like my aunt passed away, my yeah. grandfather who passed away when I was like twelve. Yeah, um, and things that she was saying of things that have happened. After, after he had passed away like between me and my father right. and like things he was saying that and it was it, she it was unreal mind-blowing because uh best experience she ever. Bet somebody gave her like a this blanket with a heart on it and and she was like he really bud really likes the heart blanket that you got and yeah she, there's no this way this woman is legit like yeah. that she is i want to go you, i know can i go can? and witness i'll just yeah. well, I, you know what it's funny i did have so i didn't know who, I, last time i just went by myself but I add when I signed up or 
requested an appointment, I did a group appointment, like just in case, right? Yeah. So it's for three people. So we should totally do it. That's up. Are you inviting us right now? Yeah, yeah. sure. Yeah. <gasps> We're going. We totally I'm so that. excited. <laughs> oh, in. <laughs> yes. August 20th. Yes. We're in. What um, day? It's, uh, oh, I don't remember. August something. This year? In 20, no, it's next year. Oh, we have got so to wait a while. Away. Guys, I know. But like how, that'd be some crazy Call fucking bonus like, material. If you have any cancellations, move me up. And it, <laughs> she's so popular that she just gets booked. And when I, I went to see her maybe two, it, Jackson was little, so maybe three years ago. Okay. I think it was before Jackson's. He was now, like, do you remember baby. how long that appointment took? Like you made it and did you have to it, wait another year? I only had to wait it like four, four to six months. Okay. Originally. So she's really gotten but more popular. friends of though. mine at work have gone... Um, and, and other people that I've talked about, they've tried to make appointments and she's like, no, I'm a year out. And so I knew that I knew she was scheduling yeah. and I made this appointment in January this year yeah. and it's not until wow. August of 2020. It's like wow. when I bought concert tickets and then that concert got postponed. Mm. I have to wait until November. For who? Fleetwood Mac. Oh, It'll be oh, worth it. I saw them before. They're amazing. I know. The only thing I'm worried about is that we have a potential wedding that we're going to that would be in Massachusetts that same weekend. Oh. And the concert would be Sunday night. So theoretically, we could oh, okay. possibly still make it. But I, I don't know. We don't. We haven't. We haven't figured it out. Like we barely know what's happening currently. Yeah. Let right. alone <laughs> several yeah. months down yeah. the line. Deal with that. That's we on got, the later we got time list. to yeah. figure it out. It's on the later list. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. That's really interesting though, Amy. All that stuff that you're just talking about. The it's blanket, me- the was- medium, all that shit's crazy. Yeah. I mean, like my mom like totally <laughs> sends me messages all the time. Um and it's entertaining most of the time because like here's a prime example. So she and I got the confirmation of this from the medium because I told my mom. So before I went originally, I told my mom because I talked to her and I told her, I'm like, listen, mom, if this woman is legit, like you need to bring up like these three, four things. Mm-hmm. And everything was talked about and brought up. Um and one of the things she said is that my mom, she's like, she, she's like, you know, she, she plays songs for you. She's like, you know, you'll get into your car and turn on the radio and a song, there's like a select few songs that like there's yeah. meaning behind with me and my mom. And she's like, that song will be on. I said, uh, oh my yeah, God. right. Crazy. Yeah. And, um, and, chills. Mm-hmm. and it would always like the time, it, it was just the timing of it was always just too convenient. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. Yeah. whether I'd be thinking about her a lot or have a hard day or like something and she would the song would come on. And these songs, obviously she's been dead eight years, so it's not like they're common songs they're that right. you hear on the radio. Well, right. g- can you give us an example of one of the songs? Um, yeah. Um uh Dynamite by Teo Cruz. Is his name Teo Cruz? Dynamite song. You'd know it if you heard it's it. Dynamite. Yes, that yeah. song. Because I, I always act like I'm blowing up dynamite, yes. by the way. <laughs> like yeah, I saw your arm yeah. there. Yes, that's, I do it. And then I go, real big arm. Yeah. The, the big one is Drops of Jupiter by Train, uh, which okay. was like our okay. song, like way back in the day when it, it was like our, like yeah. I of that CD. Like that was our song. Yeah. And that song is not something you hear no, really frequently on the radio at all. Yeah. But I hear it like frequently. Um, Cole and I were in the car the other day and. Another song, I don't even know what the song is, but it's a song that kind of came out around the time she died. And it, it told, like, I, I couldn't listen to it then because it would just get me too upset. Yeah. So it comes on and Cole's talking. And Cole's a thing with, like, no, wanting to know what year songs came out. Like, oh, I don't know. Um, so I'm like, oh, this, you know, the song reminds me of Mama Lee a lot. Like, you know, it, was, it came out right around the time she died. I'm like, I couldn't even listen to it before. Yeah. And so I'm like, no. Nah. He's like, well, you can listen to it now. And I'm like, yeah, now it's... You know, I can listen to it, but it reminds me of Mama Lee. Like it just, yeah. it it always will. And um, so the song ends, um, and then Dynamite comes on. Stop the song right after, and I just laugh. Yeah, and I laugh out loud. And I'm like, well, apparently Mama Lee's listening to <laughs> us today. She's listening. I'm like, she says oh, hi. I'm getting That's chills crazy. So, again. It won't yeah. stop. I keep getting chills from all your stories. My nipples are hard. <laughs> no, my, all my leg hair is growing back. <laughs> um. Yeah, and then my stepdad, so my so we moved in, my mom married my stepdad, and we moved in together when I was 13 into the house that is now like the family house. And so my little sister's graduating high school, and he's selling the house. And I'm like, and I knew, I've known that he was selling the house for like two weeks, and I don't know why, like this morning I wake up, and I'm like in bed, like just thinking, because I met with my siblings yesterday, we were talking, and like it hit me that I'm like... She died in that house. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And that's like the family house. And like, I'm not close with my father at all. So I don't have any like home base in that regard. Yeah. And I'm like, it's kind of like throwing me for a loop that he's selling 
the family. I mean, yeah. even though mm-hmm. like she's been gone and my family's kind of been a mess, right, like, it's right, still no. like yeah. the home base, yeah. right? Like yep. it's I'll it's, be a mess the day my parents sell like, their house. It's it's weird to me that like that's not gonna be there anymore. Right. Totally yeah. throwing me. Yeah. Big time. Yeah. No, I Yeah, I agree. I'd struggle. So I, I texted him this morning and I'm like, what's your timeline look like? I'm like, because mm-hmm. I'm sure I have shit, in, right? You always have shit at your parents' yeah, house that's in a box somewhere that's been there forever. Your blanket. My fucking blanket's there. Yep. I'm like, I need to like go and like yeah. go through my, and then like my yeah. mom's stuff is all, like what am I, I told him like, what are you doing with like, you know, the china and the crystal, the family, like the yeah. family stuff, which I didn't really fight for at the time when she died because like it didn't really, yeah, it was in the house. It time. didn't really matter, yeah. right? I mean like we, I, we went and divvied up her, her jewelry and her, some of her stuff like that, like, shortly after she died um, to make sure all the siblings got the pieces they yeah. wanted. But like the other stuff, like we were like, well, it's in the house. So it's not like it's going anywhere. Right. Um, but now I'm like, well, you want it now? I don't, I don't necessarily know if I want it. I just want to make sure that it's, I would it take goes it. to the appropriate. Yeah. I would like, take I it. Don't, I don't hold a lot of like emotional attachment to items. I'd want pictures and I want yeah. that kind of stuff. Yeah. Um, I but, don't, you figure so what if your what if your sister who's graduating high school wants that china when exactly. she's older so exactly. you can take it store it for her at your house and my little brother just bought a house yeah. so i'm sure like there are things that he, he might want for and, his house and yeah. um you know i just want to make sure that like everything gets yeah. where it's so supposed to be so is the house on the market or he's not just, yet it will be shortly. Be, okay but he's moving out of the house before so it's it's a the old original farmhouse in marshallton um, it's going to take a very specific buyer for that house. Um, just cause it, Taylor, you know, that house it, yeah. it's, it's old, it's historic. Um, and it's, wild. it's, it's, it's crazy yeah, house. like, yeah. So, um, how much do you think it's going to go for? He's selling it for 500 oh or putting God. it on the market. It $500. It, that's it. Yeah. You're done. <laughs> Sold. We're moving it needs, in. <laughs> it, he could get a lot more for it, but it needs a lot of work, work. like a lot of work. Um, just because it's been a lot for him to upkeep since my mom passed away and he's got the two kids. And I mean, yeah. it's a five bedroom. Actually, it might be considered more than that. Um, anyway, but it's a huge house. So, um, yeah. but he's moving out, right? Not until Becca graduates after that. So I think the end of June, he's moving out and then they're putting it on the market. Where is he going to though? He owns another house. Oh, okay. Um, so up just... in Coatesville that he's going to move into. Okay. And he has a farm in South Carolina. That right now he goes to kind of frequently. I'm assuming that once the kids are uh, out of high school, out. he'll be there a lot. And she's she's the your sister's the last one to graduate. Yes. Finally, so crazy. Mm-hmm. I told I said to my brother, I'm like, you realize that like as of next, because she just turned 19. I'm like next year, like all of us are going to be like in our 20s or older. Like that's it's just yeah. weird because I was 15 when she was born, um, or around that. So it's just been like they've always been like yeah. the, the kids. That's what we call it, the kids. Because they're the two youngest. Yes, of, like, I, the group yeah, of us. I call them the, my two. I, we call them the little ones. Yeah, we're always yeah. the little ones. Yeah, Matt, my sister and I were always the girls because we were the younger. So I have three older siblings, and then there's like a about a seven year gap between Maggie and Tom, and then the girls, and then it was Maggie and I. So we were always the girls, and now my sister has girls. So it's like, well, the girls, well, the older girls are the well, which girls? Little girls, yeah. <laughs> there's four. <laughs> they need their own name because the girls yeah. is taken. That's yours. The girls so. and the big girls and the little girls and. Yeah, I don't know. So, but anyway, crazy. that was my emotional roller coaster this weekend. Yeah, Allison, how's your weekend? Did you wait? Did you win oh. at game night? Is there? Oh a no! Victory? Right. So, <laughs> my brother really likes games, and like he has a lot of them. But they're like game. They're not like we're not like playing life, game? right? Like if they're we actually, it's really fun. It's called Thirteen Clues. It's like Clue, <gasps> but like I'm a in. To- you would love it, I'm Jackie. In. You would totally <laughs> love it. It's like next level. So you've got there's cards. There's no board. You've got these like cardboard barriers you put up in front of you and there's slots in the front of it for three cards so everybody has three cards in front of them and then you can see two cards on your side okay ultimately the, you have to guess what the three third. cards are in front of you that you can't see that everybody else can see and you go around and you ask questions like jackie how many um long range weapons do you see right now and so you answer and then you have to figure out you have like a little piece of paper with all the cards and you mark the ones off that you have to yeah. get clues and things okay to figure out what cards you can't see. We want to um, do a murder mystery dinner. Oh, they're so fun. I haven't, I've never done one. And you I would want, really like it. Need to do one. You would 
fucking killed that yeah. game. Let's no pun intended. Yeah, <laughs> I did one one with my, I'm the my murderer. Up, we at Magianos, um, a few years ago with my in laws, and it was, and I wasn't sure like what is this going to be. It was so, so fun. much fun. Are they doing it again? I don't know. I, we'd have All to right, look. Well, let's look it up. We'll look I'm totally it up. in though. I mean, they do them like. Well, it's funny because we were we were in the car talking about it, and then like a couple days later, I was like, "What were we gonna get on Groupon and look for?" Mm-hmm. And then it was like twenty minutes later, I was like, <gasps> "Murder mystery dinner!" Like it <laughs> like dawned on me. They're awesome. So we're gonna have to. They're look a it good up. time. Like I know, like the Strasburg Railroad does murder mystery stuff. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. But so you get a train ride That'd be and fun. to solve a murder. Oh, and when it comes time, like. Fall things. We all need to do like a podcast hayride. On oh, that could be fun. That would be well, so that would be hayride so or just funny. a hayride. Because I overreact at haunted. I things. think it should be haunted. So do I. Yeah, but like, oh, Jackie, me. there's one at Magiano's May 31st. <gasps> like so soon. I can't. I have a God. bachelorette party. There's a comedy murder mystery dinner show. May 20th. Oh, that's May 25th. That's like at the Double Tree Hilton in Philadelphia. Um, Can't make it to Philly on, during the week. How about June twenty eighth? Oh, there's maybe. a murder mystery dinner for Make a Wish, which is a good cause. Where's that at? Magianos, the one in King of Prussia. Oh yeah, I don't know. I was like, I don't know. I assume there's more than one Magianos. But. There's an eighties murder mystery dinner. Oh, this oh. is May thirty first. Ah, again, sorry, that wouldn't work. <laughs> yeah, okay. so it looks like there's a bunch. So of we're them. gonna look up Magianos for June. Magianos. It'd be so much fun. Hopefully, we don't. What day of the week is that? When's the twenty eighth? I'm sweating so much my thumb my thumbprint yeah. won't pop up. <laughs> I think I'd be, I'd I'd be really June bad 28th. at that game. It's a Friday. <laughs> yeah. A Friday night. Um, Allison, you don't have to be good. You just I have really to be sitting be at a table with someone who is good. Because yeah. like my sister-in-law Kelly went and she's like, she'll talk to anybody. She was like in it, right? Because she's very competitive yeah. and she was, you know. And so I just kind of like she tagged piggybacked up with all her. Clues and solved it probably. Right? And I just like all the glory. let her like, because you have to like talk to everybody and there's, People at different tables who are actors, you just don't know. You oh. think they have tickets like you do. Yeah. And they're like going along and you're talking and then somebody just like there's a, somebody gets so shot. I could and pretend so I was an actor. Yeah, you could totally I do that. I think that's what I'll do. You could do that and then throw <laughs> other tables off. That's what I think I'm We ended do. up winning. Okay. And it was because of Kelly. Okay. Like totally. <laughs> so we'll bring her. Yeah, she can come too. Yeah. She's really good. You, Jackie, you would be so yeah. into that. Yeah. Oh, you I was watching that. Forensic Files this morning. I'm like, yeah, that guy definitely <laughs> did it. Got this. Like, the son left the house, guys, and did it. Like, called 911, didn't even check to see if his dad was technically still alive. And then he drove himself to the police station. What? Yeah. Yeah, obviously. Guilty. Yeah, you got this. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. I lay there in bed. <laughs> um, so, Alzam, real quick, what'd you do? Um, so we went to the fair last night. Oh, the accident. Oh, the accident fair. I got. Did go. you spend I, loads and loads of money for that thing? I did. It was it was so crowded. I can't even. I I've I never avoided seen it that like that year. in my life. I avoided it. I'm like I can't. I it was hate that insane. thing. Like the lines to go on Tilt a Whirl, which I can't do rides anymore because I last year at the accident You're fair I threw old. up, guys. Okay, oh. I'll admit it. I vomited. After Tilda World, <laughs> I threw up. <laughs> no, rides affect me differently now as like, I get I older. Do, and I love Tilda World. Like, I laugh so hard you can hear me as I spin like the, <laughs> like the cackle. Tilda World's yeah. great. Yeah. I love it. I got off and I was like, holy shit. Fuck. Yeah. yeah. I was like, I'm going to throw up. And I did. Um, but the lines were like, I've never seen it. You were in line for a half hour. Damn. And it's such a little, it's packed yeah. into such a it small was, yeah, area. It insane. Well, and it feels even smaller now because of Whole Foods. Whole Foods is there. Yeah, they took up half the uh, room. So maybe that's why I really thought like they weren't going to do the small. fair in that location I don't, anymore I don't even once know Whole how Foods they fit, went like, in. You look at that parking lot yeah. when they're not there and it's like, how do they fit all these yeah. fucking rides in there? And like the one guy was it's like, ridiculous. you got to get out of the street. I'm like, where do you want me to go? Yeah. yeah. I have nowhere to go. Yeah. It was insane. Um, normally, my friend uh, Jenna Bear and I, we go and we... It's normally like after a soccer game, we go on like a Sunday and we'll yeah. ride. We'll go and get, get, we'll buy just enough to, we'll walk first. We're like, okay, we want to go on this ride. We need maybe this, this ride. Many tickets. We need this many And you can never get the right amount of tickets. Right. Of course not. So then we always walk around after we ride the rides we wanted to go on. And then we always look for a family. We're like, they look, That's what they, I, yep. they need, I, they look yeah. like they need some tickets. Like certain okay. families just like have tickets galore. And I'm like, Let's look for the others like my family who are like, like okay, we look guys, like they're kind of counting their and and that's tickets. It. <laughs> yeah. Well, we only got on one ride. That's how packed it and was. And you're probably there for two hours. 
We did played you, a lot of games. I was gonna say you guys do okay. games. Yeah, we did. Oh, and they charge My so friend much was money. there yesterday, and she won two goldfish, and she said uh, she then released them. Not really into the wild. I, I don't was like, can I have goldfish? Those games. Like, Dude, like we can't even find your frog. <laughs> I can't take on two more fish. Did you see Dude. the vi- the video? Yes, you've seen it because you Danny, saw- I think, tagged oh, you. Yeah, I saw that on your Facebook. <laughs> I laughed there's so this, okay, hard. So there's this little frog on this kid's arm, and he's freaking. The mother yeah. is like laughing yeah. hysterically. Which I like, would what? be the same way. And she goes to like get it, and the yeah. frog jumps in the kid's mouth. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> and you hear not her like inside, just she like loses it, and the kid is like screaming. We'll have nightmares for the rest of his life. Hopefully, about this I think moment. he's gonna grow up and look back and laugh. Like, oh yeah, there's so sure. many things I look back on and I'm like, that easily could have scarred me, but now I can laugh. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> it goes one way or the other. Yeah. 50 50 shot, really. <laughs> it was so funny. I had to kill a spider yesterday when I was cleaning. It was very jumpy, and I was like, Ooh, uh, we had we have special like spray that can kills like spiders, roaches, things like that. So I was just like, it was like up on the buffet table. Yeah. So it was like one squirt, and I'm like, oh my god, it kept jumping out of the way. The it was thing? like a game yes. for him. It was like Frogger. Eventually got it. I sprayed that thing right in the face. <gasps> and then I was you. like, and then I was like pledging everything down. I'm like, there's your dead body. <laughs> and I threw him out. <laughs> and Taylor was texting me. My phone was Bye. charging. And I was like, sorry, I had a battle. A very battle jumpy spider. spider. I, I was like, I didn't cry. I didn't scream. I didn't overreact. Look Not like go. me. Guys, I'm growing up. <laughs> so proud of you. Yeah. I have a stiff neck from a spider over the week. Oh, so yeah. We got to talk about that. Yeah. Let's, yeah. Talk let's, about that. let's yeah. go on break right yeah. now. So uh, we're going to be right back with more Relatable Radio. Loud, brash, controversial, and now completely uncensored. Foundation Radio is joining the Might Be News Network. Foundation Radio, exclusively on the Might Be News Network podcast. Just search Might Be News Network to listen and subscribe on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, and everywhere podcasts are found. New episodes every other Thursday. Welcome back to Relatable Radio. Just real quick, you can find us and all the other fantastic podcasts at mbnnetwork.com. Guys, it's never been easier. mbnnetwork.com. You have your your choice. Yep. I mean, choose Relatable Radio, but you have your choice of platform. So whatever your heart desires, <laughs> just choose us. If you're listening to us now, chances are they chose us. Already, yeah, that's true. But, that's yes. true. but just continue to choose us. And yeah. you know what? Give give the other shows a listen. They're good too. They're good too. I think too. they're getting a little salty because we always talk about how great we are. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah. if the shoe fits, whatever. Yeah. Um, they're I mean, great we too. We can't help it that we're better we're, than We're not that, saying but... they're bad. We're just yeah. saying we're, we're better. better. <laughs> There's a difference, a very distinct difference. I don't know why people wouldn't wouldn't want to listen to this show. Yeah. There's. I mean, I know Steve show. was very excited to come on mm-hmm. Relatable Radio. Yes, he was. I know Kevin is dying to come on Relatable Radio. <laughs> yeah. John's been on Relatable Radio. Yeah. yeah. loves yeah. being on I Relatable mean, Radio. Also, did your sister like being on? She did. She was like super nervous, but it was so funny. So before we, in the car, she goes, you know, I think I might be really good at it because I did the morning announcements at high school. I was like, (laughs) oh. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, that's all it takes? Okay, then. She's like, why are you laughing? I'm like, because you're stupid. (laughs) (laughs) That's that sibling love, right? No. (laughs) So dumb. Um, Wait, so right before we went on a break, you started talking about a spider story. Yeah, so I was on my way home from work and the windows were down because it was nice. And I was like... I'm going to take, you know, the extra time because I'm in the car by myself. Go the back and, way. Right. Like, I'm just, just going to take the radio my time and enjoy on, it. Enjoy yeah, it. So. Windows down. I and love then, that like, feeling. I'm driving and I see, like, this, like, shadow on my steering wheel. And I, like, oh, God. Did, what, what was that? I'm driving still. And then I see it. And it's the size of a quarter. Ooh. And it's walking on my steering wheel to my other hand. Like, is it walking across your ste- steering yeah. wheel? Yeah. Like, it's like, literally, yeah. It was on the other side, like, Jesus. where my hands were. Yeah. So, so I knew you, it was coming you, for you me. You immediately took your hands off the wheel. Obviously. Well, I <laughs> did like, I smacked it. <laughs> <laughs> She's backhanding spiders, guys. Badass. And then I didn't know where it went. That's and it's the problem with doing like, back that. roads. So I'm driving with my two, with my thumb and my pointer yeah. finger. Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> I can't, I can't drive. I'd be crying. Just, like, yeah. 
<laughs> and I end up, I'm like, oh my God, I need to pull over. Yeah. So smart. <laughs> yeah. So of course there's nowhere to go because it's just all back like and- houses in the back roads. And I find this business and um, I pull in, but it's like, there's like a fence blocking it now because you're not allowed in anymore. Um, so I pull over, the music's still blaring, my car is still on. And um, like the back of my car is almost in the road. That's only how I could do it. Yeah. And I am out of the car doing this dance I've never done before, like a spider dance, I yeah. guess. <laughs> it's a draw and the spider out. The spider out. was on my Challenge. leg. <gasps> I know. Did you not oh, know that until no. you got out I'm of the car? I'm doing that shake. Like, like, oh, if no. anyone's ever seen Matilda when she has the lizard on, the principal has a lizard on her <gasps> yes. chest, that's me. That's, Trunch okay, bowl. That's, if you yes. need a visual, go look it that's up. That's perfect. That's me. Okay. okay. I can so. totally see this now. That helps. <laughs> I can laugh because it's you. If this happened to me, I'd be crying. I'd be and calling like, so yeah. many people. <laughs> um, So a car goes by and I'm like, oh my God, they're going to think something's wrong. All right. And it turns around like, fuck, here we go. <laughs> And I'm sure they must have seen this dance. And I, the window goes down. I look, and they're like, "Allison." And I was like, "What the fuck?" And I was who like, is "Who is that?" And they're like, "It's it's me. It's your neighbor." And I was like, "Oh my god!" They're like, "Are you all right?" And I was like, "How? Yeah, wait, there's how far were you from your house? Like 15 minutes." And your That's, neighbor just what are they at to be at driving like by nine o'clock, dude? That she's on this back road. That's crazy. And she's oh, like, you. "Are you all right? Did you hit something?" And I was like, "No. Um, <clears throat> it was a, it was a spider." <laughs> She's like, it's what? I'm like, it was a fucking spider. Okay? It was huge. It was the mother of all spiders. Dude. But I got it. I'm coming home. <laughs> see you in the neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll see you at home, neighbor. My sister. I was oh, but driving- I did. I I did during that dance. I got a stiff neck. Uh, I'm still recovering. <laughs> yeah. So he fought back. So I I did moves I haven't done in a long time. So. You gotta stretch sometimes yeah. before you do these dances. No. But you never know when the mood's gonna strike. So it's a small price to pay yeah. for safety. Huh. I uh, no, I was in the car with my sister a couple weeks ago, and she starts pointing. We're on the turnpike, and I'm sitting there going, "I think she's pointing at traffic." I'm like, "I don't see like it's open road up there. Like yeah. all the traffic's moving." And she's like, "It's inside," and I see it. It's like a blonde, like tannish color spider. Oh, yeah. That's what. Crawling yeah. across her windshield. Nope. And it I was, was like, inside. yeah. And she's like, I saw this thing the other day. I had no idea what happened to it. So I take my sandal off and I kill it. Right. Yeah. yeah. And then like the body's on the bottom of my sandal. But we're. What are you going to do? I can't. So I, I had to. I left. You it, threw your sandal up. out the window? No. Oh. <laughs> no, we were going to an event. We were Lucky going to an event at a restaurant. Like you definitely need yeah, shoes. Yeah. So I, um, I just left my shoe off. And when we got there, I like. Yeah. Hit it on the ground. It's amazing and, what you do when you're in that moment. Yeah. So what you find to kill. I was in kill, the car. This happened what you do. not even two weeks ago with um, my two girlfriends from work. We were heading to Wegmans for lunch. And I'm in the back seat. They're in the front seat. And she has a sunroof. And I see it like it, they're talking. Like they don't know what's going on. And I can see it in the sunroof at the top like crawling across. And I very casually. Like, I, yeah. I'm like looking around. I'm like, okay, I don't want to distract I'm her not from casual. driving. Right? And I know like it would be a thing yeah. if I told her the spider was above her head. Oh so like God. I can't find anything. So I casually just take off my shoe. I'm like, guys, don't worry. I got this. And they're like, what? What, what do you mean? Because <laughs> I have my shoe like in between I them. got this. Oh I will God. save you. <laughs> I will save you. And I just very casually, I killed a spider and I put my shoe back on. They're like, what the fuck just happened? I'm like, don't, it's fine. I got it taken care of. It was not that big. Okay. It, I mean, it was... Yeah, it wasn't. So, I mean, it wasn't. I feel like big enough for you to notice. Whatever. It, does, it doesn't really yeah. matter how big it is. Yes, yeah, sometimes it does. Hey, That's it's all said. about the motion in the ocean, right? <laughs> Not the size of the boat. So we're gonna need spider. a bigger boat. We <laughs> <laughs> need a bigger flip flop. Yeah, we need a bigger flip flop. <laughs> uh, but yeah, they were like, "Man, look at you!" Like totally. I was like, "They were like, you, how are you? Were just so calm and collected." I'm like, "I don't know. It just came over me that You're I was right. like, I have to save them." So you're yeah. like that in that situation. Yeah. Not yes, me. I'm that person. But are your are Not your me. kids scared of bugs or spiders? Oh, Cole is terrified. He screams like a little girl and will start bawling, crying if he suspects <laughs> that a spider is around him. Is it just spiders? Like, how does he feel about like other weird, um, creepy, collie things? I, it's. I'm not sure, but really, spiders, spiders. are really what what mm. gets to him. He gets that from Kevin. Kevin's afraid of them. Oh yeah, I have to kill the spiders in my house. Really? Kevin won't do it. Fucking I can't do this. Like if it, if I think it's gonna crunch, I'm out. I can't do it. Mm. That's why you gotta weaken mm. them with spray. I've used Febreze 
the weekend. You know, the only bug I actually say because I can't stand them or the crunch or the smell of stink bugs. Stink bugs don't bother me at all. What? They used to. They're just everywhere. To me, they're just like, oh, what's up, buddy? And I just like get them out or I'll just like flush them. I don't don't have a lot of rude. They are rude bugs. Stink bugs anymore. (laughs) I had a house where one like literally flew and hit me in the ear. Yeah, they don't care. And I freaked out when I was talking to a neighbor several years ago. (laughs) And I was like, God, I was like, it was a stink bug. Yeah, it just it literally try to fly care. into my right. ear. I was eating mashed potatoes one time and right in the mashed potatoes. <laughs> they just don't give a okay, fuck. Well, that's that's a whole new so that's level. suicide. Probably. And then like you, they go and like they fly, and then you hear them. They're like ding. Yeah, like you like, hear where they land. Uh-huh. I but uh, we don't Dumb. we don't have them here. Like they're not. Mm. I don't see. Yeah, any I don't have apartment. them in my house. Not either. would they haven't been. They're at my mom's. Like you can't go in the front door. Oh really? It's they're like everywhere. a death mission. Like I feel like it'd be like Game of Thrones. Like you're going on a mission here. And you yeah. have to survive. Instead of White Bring Walkers. Bring your dragons. Have you, of White Walkers, wait, did you try to watch? Not yet. Okay. I, I do. Danny and I, it was like midnight. Danny's like, you want to you start watching? I'm like, I'm never going to make it through. <laughs> no. It's, well, yeah. Nope. Like, no. it's way too late. So. It happens. Yeah. I did watch that movie, though. Um, Which one? I didn't like it. Which Last one? summer. You didn't like it? I didn't. I you was know what? I'm bored. <laughs> I watched it a couple. Did you like it? Too? I I need to rewatch because I feel like I feel I like I need to rewatch it. Too. I need to rewatch it. I also started to watch Someone Great. Was that the other one? Yes. Um, but I definitely that, I was watching I it this was morning. Funny. I woke up early, so um, Taylor's mom and stepdad are in town this weekend. They purposely planned a Saturday to Monday trip because John was traveling, and John got stuck in Texas yesterday. So it created a little bit of havoc and he's still um, not home. He's still not really? home. Oh my God. <laughs> They're getting the planes getting ready to take off. He's not had much like the travel luck he's having is like that would happen to me. <laughs> it's like not catastrophic bad. right yes, now. Yes, it's him. so bad. They overfueled the plane. What? So they had it on to burn off the extra fuel. Like, how do you do that? I mean, I guess it's better than underfueling. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah. If I was gonna but how about one. you just do your job? <laughs> right, right. So the issue was Robin had to be at work this morning. Yeah. So they're texting me. And I told Robin yesterday because we all got together for dinner without John. <laughs> and I was like, Robin, I know like like Lori and Carl are offering to help you. But like if grandparents can't do it and Whatever. they're not Whatever in town, need, let me know. like we're available you know we can make ourselves available if you need help so john's texted me last night like can you go watch the girls i was like i can i'm supposed to record at 10 a.m i have a bridal shower at one he's like oh never mind i need someone most of the day i'm like listen your parents were talking about going over in the morning anyway so like i can go watch them until they get there and so i um he's like okay well i'll have robin get in touch with you in the morning so me i can't sleep normal anyway i was just i naturally woke up i set an alarm for 6 30 just in case and then i um i got up at like six i was like you know what let me just i'll turn my alarm off let me go take a shower because i was worried that i would run out of time Mm -hmm. that i wouldn't have time to shower and get ready so i was like let me just be prepared for the day so but she ended up not needing us to to help him out this time but so you get a nice early start to the day, though. Yeah. yeah. So I watched someone great, and I had started to fall back asleep because I was just naturally tired at that point. It was like eight eight thirty in the morning, maybe. Yeah. Now it was probably like seven thirty. So I just like started to doze off. So I was like, I need to rewatch it. I really uh, liked her uh, black friend in the show yeah, she, or movie. She was yeah. really funny. Yeah. They, no, I like their whole friendship. I saw the a whole dynamics of, of the three good. of them is really funny. Yeah. yeah, I should watch that tonight. There's a lot of like. It's not for children to watch at all by yeah, any no. stretch of the imagination. No, There's a yeah. lot of language, a lot of sex and Ooh, drugs. Yeah, and, yeah. yeah, it's really good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Gotta watch cool. that alone. Cool. So. <laughs> cool. Cool. Yeah. 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 I know what I'm doing tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I know what we're doing tonight. I know what we're doing tonight. Game of Thrones. Tonight is the, it's Sunday. Like we said earlier, it's the final episode ever. Series finale. Are not you guys uh, signing a petition? No, 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 no. I think people are fucking ridiculous. I think, I think they're fucking stupid. Ridiculous. Okay. Yeah. Danny's always been a crazy bitch. You guys have just forgotten that she's a crazy bitch. Yeah. Yep. Go well, back and look, guys. So wait, what happened? People the signs weren't were there. happy with how it went? 
Oh, people yeah, are up this, in arms. This season's rushed. They easily could have extended this out to be at least eight episodes. Yeah. Like they could have. Really, like I can be honest about it. Yeah, it's but overall, rushed. I've but enjoyed we knew this. It was going to be rushed. There's only a handful of episodes. Like, yeah. tell me, nobody thought that. Right. That right. like, hmm, it's going to be rushed. My my whole minutes. point against the petition is that they were never ever ever going to please everyone. No, no, the they show, were never ever going to please everyone. You know, going into watching this show, that they're that they will do. Nothing that happens is what you expect to happen. Right. They will no. always throw you and be like, I didn't see that coming at all, which is why everybody likes the show so much. Your exit music's getting ready to start, just so you guys know, oh, so you aren't scared by it. <laughs> and don't like, oh, just yeah. stop. Wow. Yeah. Is that Taylor? <laughs> it's um, coming right now. Oh. But every, everybody knows that, like, they will kill off your favorite characters. There's no loyalty to anybody. No. It, you never know what's going to happen. And this is no different than that. Yeah. I read a thing in IMDb saying that they, the writers of the show, were had three moments of holy shit. And the third holy shit moment happens in tonight's episode. Well, it better. It's the last, like, there's yeah. got to be. If you, if you want to keep listening, search for us on Patreon.com. Hopefully, you'll be able to find us and subscribe. Otherwise, this is basically the end of the episode for you. And uh, tune in next week. You're going to miss all the great stuff we're about to talk about. Yeah. We're going to be talking we about so much more stuff. We've seen the best for last. For, for, for another, <laughs> a whole another half hour. Thanks yeah. for listening, guys. 